Hello, and welcome to LS Spooky. I'm your host, Soul Rock the Innocent. Tonight, we're going to take a look at a couple of paranormal videos and see if they are truly paranormal or if maybe we can debunk them. So why don't you sit back, relax, and we'll take a dive into the world of the supernatural and the paranormal. Our first video comes from Odd Explorer 2735 on Reddit. Now this video is truly strange because you can clearly see vapor like something <laughs> pass by at a distance and from the looks of it, it looks like it could be a ghost, but from the angle and just given the distance, we can't really tell for sure if it's just a person that's skimming by or if it truly is something paranormal. But what do you think? Leave a comment in the comments below. Our second video comes from Resident Science 525 on Reddit. Now in this video, you can clearly see something vapor-like, ghost-like, pass by in front of the staircase. So to me, it could be something paranormal. Definitely looks like a ghost to me. But what do you think? So leave a comment below. Our third video comes from Anonymous Figures NFT from Reddit. Now in this video, it's very interesting because you can clearly see a black figure appear on the camera. However, if you look at it carefully, you can see that it's more likely a bug that has landed in front of the camera lens because the camera is not able to focus. It just <laughs> spreads it out and makes it look like it's this black mass. But it, the, the way that it moves, it's moving right in front of the camera. It's not moving three dimensionally. So that's why I think it's just a bug that has landed on top of the camera lens. But what do you think? Is it a bug or is it a ghost? Our fourth video comes from Stone Cold Steve Autism on Reddit. Now this video, guys, uh, to be honest with you, it looks pretty cool, but to me, it's just a case of video compression issues. You can see the figure way too clearly, in my opinion, and I don't know, it, it just seems like obvious video compression issues because it is way, way too, it's just, it's too present, it's too there. So I don't know, it's just, it can't be, paranormal because it doesn't even look that translucent you can just see that it's a guy <laughs> you know he comes in and out of focus but uh, i think that's just more an issue of video compression so what do you think though is it paranormal or is it just a case of good old-fashioned video compression issues comment below our fifth video 
is courtesy of Blizzard SC from Reddit. Well, friends, from that video, well, how do I put this? There seems to be a bit too much happening in that video. And for me, from what I see, it just appears to be some sort of insect that has landed in front of the camera and is causing the camera to lose focus. And it causes a shape to appear. But because, again, the camera cannot focus when it's right in front of the lens, the insect, then it makes it look like this weird wobbly figure. But if you look clearly, it just looks like there's a swarm of insects flying around and something just lands in front of the lens. Sometimes things are just bugs and there's nothing paranormal about it, but it looks still pretty cool. But what do you think? Just a bug or could it be a paranormal incident or ghost? Our sixth video comes from C. Holly Molly from Reddit. Now this video I find very interesting. It, I guess it can't be classified as something that's paranormal. However, it is apparently supernatural. In the video, you can see flashing lights in the sky. And just by the way that it's just, the way that it's very still in the sky and the way that the lights are shaped, it would appear as if it's a spaceship and that the lights are surrounding some sort of triangular-like figure which could be a spaceship however if you think logically it could also be a formation of helicopters i wouldn't say necessarily airplanes because they were moving a bit too slow but if we are going to be thinking logically then i would say helicopters however to me it probably is a spaceship because i believe in aliens but what do you think <laughs> aliens or helicopters Leave a comment below. Our seventh video comes from Ethan Crawshaw from Reddit. Now this video uh, is a bit iffy for me. Hmm. It is more than likely a bug because if you see on the video, it, first of all, it's filmed from a camera that's being recorded from a computer screen. So the dimensions are a bit um, skewed, I would say. But if you see carefully, it would appear as if something just appears on the camera lens and then disappears. Uh, I would say that's more than likely either a spider leg or some sort of insect leg that just happened to just swing by in front of the camera and then lost focus because it's too close to the camera so it made it look that way. I don't think it's paranormal but what do you think? Could that be actually a ghost or could it be like what I think an insect leg? Leave a comment below. Our eighth video comes from Mystical Goddess 23 from Reddit. Okay, so I've been trying to take 
a picture of this. I'm so, my nerves are so messed up. Like, I, I can't even breathe. Like, I'm so, I'm so nervous. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. Of course, it looked a lot better earlier. Like, wow. For, um, uh, any of you guys that know me, um, not the ones that you don't know. But as soon, do y'all see that though? Um, I was gonna do this live, but I didn't really know how, and I was in such a hurry. But anyway. Now this video here, we're going to approach with a little bit of care. This woman has obviously gone through a very traumatic event in losing her child. So I think in this case, it is a simple case of pareidolia. She's seeing what she wants to see, and she's seeing something that has a human attribute, in this case, an eye, that their child used to draw in the past. Now, this is not to make fun of her or anything like that, but we have to approach these things with care because the woman is obviously in pain. But in this case, unfortunately, I don't think it's anything more but pareidolia. But what do you think? Paranormal event or just par uh, pareidolia? Our ninth video comes from Regular Joe 500 on Reddit. Now this video, <laughs> I mean, I see this video and I just see a horse. And to be honest with you, it's, it's just a horse. <laughs> you can see the horse. It doesn't even just materialize. It just appears. Like it just walks onto the screen and walks off the screen. I know that the man says that the, the, his horse died and the horse that he had before was black and that this horse is white. But if you just, if you think logically, it shows a video of just a regular horse walking up the screen. So to me, it's just a horse. But what do you think? Could it be a ghost horse? Or is it just a regular horse? What do you think? Leave a comment below. And our last video comes from Heidi and Truck Mom from Reddit. Now this video here, well, I'm sorry to say, but I think it's, again, just another bug. If you look at the way that the the, the shadow or the thing, uh, it, it just appears like something lands on the camera lens and just walks down and then walks to the side. It doesn't even float in an ethereal fashion. It just seems like a bug landed on the camera lens and made it go out of focus and just continue walking on its merry way. So for me, it's just another insect. But what do you think? Could it be an insect or something paranormal? <laughs> well, my friends, I hope you enjoyed a little stroll into the paranormal that we just took. Some videos were paranormal, some videos were not. But what did you think? Did you think that they were all paranormal? Could they all be explained logically? Or is it just a case of misunderstanding? What do you think? Anyways, I hope that you join me next time when we dive into more strange and unusual videos like that and see if we can, you know, classify them as actually truly paranormal or debunk them as something that can be explained easily just by applying a slight bit of logic. I hope that you enjoyed your time here and that I will see you soon. Until next time, friends, take care.